what's up everyone a little different of video so I've been having issues <clears throat> you remember back with the laser not cutting right and I thought you know it's the wood and everything turns out it wasn't the wood it's a laser tube so I've been getting um, two burn marks the today and I couldn't figure it out I called them they walked me through we did uh, took the laser tube out there's another internal lens in there. They had me look and clean. Um, I went to cut, and it's the same thing. Instead of two dots farther apart, I got it to where they come together a little bit, and it's a big oval, but it's still not cutting right, and engraving has been a way different too now. So they're saying that they pretty much think it's the internal lens that we can't get at without taking the laser tube apart, which they won't let me. So that has to come apart. Um, by them so I have to switch it out now if you're wondering about a laser an epilogue and what the tube costs it's not a cheap tube it's not the same price as a co2 water cooled but I have to remember that it's convenience like I just plug and plug and play I don't have to worry about any cooler or anything um, I talked to Austin at Epilogue, he's a great guy, he helped me out, very good, nice. The laser tube, for me to get it faster, I have to pay $4,694. Yes, $4,694. Now, once I receive the tube, because they do overnight air, I will get the tube, therefore take this tube out, put this tube into the box put the new tube in take the old tube and ship it back to them as soon as they receive it I get back twenty four hundred dollars so essentially I pay twenty two hundred and nine or yeah twenty two hundred ninety four dollars for this tube so and this is a 60 watt now you're probably asking well Matt how old is it how old is that tube well Good question. Four years old since they've replaced it. And the last time they replaced it, it was under warranty. So they sent out a new tube, which they said it's a two year warranty. So you can bet your dollar I'm going to run this sucker until I can't. <laughs> I'm going to run it every day as much as I can. I'm going to pound some work through it. I'm going to work this thing and see what it's like and see if it'll last. I want to. <laughs> I'm just gonna run and cut as much as I can. Uh, they said typically it's about five years. They they try to tell one five to six years. The tubes will go out. That's what he told me on the phone. Um, I unfortunately didn't get that, <clears throat> but that's all right. I do run it a lot, and I I don't think people know how much I run it, and especially he asked like how much am I running, and I typically run this thing is running minimum eight hours a day and it's not just monday through friday it's monday through monday so i run this every single day unless i'm gone at a cabin and then but then it also you have to remember holiday season the big rush that's you're running non-stop i mean i'm we're running this 24 7 so it gets it gets used it gets a lot of hours on it and that's you know the price I have to pay but it's worth it in my eyes it just is a blow right now and it stinks so yeah bummer but guess what the next video is gonna be me installing a new laser tube so if you haven't seen that done it's pretty simple actually they have it set up really easy um, yeah there's really nothing else for me to say other than I hope you guys are selling the crap out of things right now and just cruising along and doing great because the market's coming back. It definitely is. We're getting really busy and I am just, I'm ecstatic, I'm pumped, I am excited because we, this year we went into a lull, it was a couple months where we didn't, we weren't doing good at all and that's why I was taking some side jobs just periodically because it was to keep me busy for one and I didn't spend as much out of my savings. So now it's coming back and the laser tube goes out. So, you know what that means? When it rains, it pours. We're going to get a ton of orders. I just know it.
And now this is on a Tuesday. Yeah. So, and I, they're saying I probably won't get the laser tube until the following next Monday. Whew. So I'm going to be backed up. But I'm going to limp this along. I'm just going to slow everything down. I can't do any cutting, so so what, but I can do the engraving. So I'm just going to limp it along. I'm going to slow all my setting, take all my settings and make, make them probably 10% lower than I normally do and see how it etches there and go from there because I need to get some of this stuff out, especially for the stuff that people need right away. Hence, that's the why. That's another reason. Good thing you're watching this video. It's another reason why you, I always say three to six business days because something like this happens you have that six business days to float your cross. So if someone orders on Monday, then that following Tuesday, you have to make sure that order goes out. So you got to think about that kind of stuff. That's why we don't do three to five because if someone orders on a Monday, it's supposed to be out that next Monday. It gives you a little bit of leeway. So I know I can just let everything be time I get the tube because I'll have it by Monday at the latest, they said. So I could be just fine and then we could ship everything out, you know, Monday afternoon and Tuesday morning. And we'd be all right, but that's not what I like to do. I like to, if someone orders, I like to be out in three days. So I'm just going to stay ahead of it. So I hope you're doing great. And if you aren't, you should be. <laughs> I don't know. I'm getting all whack-a-mole. Glad you got to see me again. <laughs> Bye.